There are so many great and inspirational people that are connecting with area youth and providing positive impacts on them. And we are chatting with a volunteer from the Big Brothers Big Sisters of Great Lakes Bay. And joining me now is Rich. Hey, Rich. Hello. Hi. Good afternoon. Yeah. So tell us what motivated you to basically become a big. Yeah, I, I think just um, being involved in the community and um, um, actually making another friend, you know, it's, it's great to have a, a friendship and a relationship with uh, a little in this case. I, you know, it's a win-win relationship. Uh, I get a friendship out of it and he gets a big brother out of it and uh, maybe a mentor and uh, we support each other through this journey we called life. <laughs> well, tell us about your little. How did you guys uh, become connected? Yeah, I was matched with um, him about uh, eight years ago and um, met with a Big Brothers Big Sisters representative and they kind of walked me through the process and they did all of the kind of behind the scenes matchmaking work. So talk about the experience, like what do you guys do? Yeah, I mean, he, he kind of, we, we kind of go back and forth and talk or text and, and brainstorm ideas. Sometimes right. it's really just simple. We go for a walk, pick him up from school and we'll go for a walk or we'll find a basketball court. And I've always got a, you know, I've always got a basketball in my car, or a football in my car and, mm -hmm. you know, maybe a, a baseball and a couple mitts and we'll play catch. Uh, a lot of times it's just hanging out and talking, whether we just go have a burger at McDonald's or maybe some ice cream at the local ice cream parlor. It's just uh, spending quality time with him. It makes a difference for both of us, I think. Talk about why programs like this one is so important to connect to youth like in that way. Yeah, you use a, a really good operative word there, connect. You know, um, I think kind of coming out of COVID, maybe we lost some of our connections and relationships in the community. And for me anyways, it was, I mean, again, I, I think there's a, a reciprocating benefit here. I benefit by having a relationship. He benefits by having a relationship. I get to see the world through his lens, his perspective, and he gets to see the world kind of a little bit maybe through my perspective. We learn from each other. What are you hoping your little walks away with, you know, because you said he's a sophomore now. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's a big deal. Deal, you mm -hmm. know, he's on his way to college soon. What lessons would you like him to walk away with during the time that you guys have spent together? Yeah, no, that's a great question. The most powerful thing that he's ever said to me, and it was pretty recent, was that uh, he hopes that one day when he gets old enough and becomes an adult and has a job um, and, uh, and is ready, he wants to do the same thing. He wants to be a mentor. He wants to mentor mm -hmm. young children as well. And uh, I think that's great. I think that we, you know, we're starting, hopefully we're starting something, right? Yeah. We start a generation of mm -hmm. youth that will have a positive mentorship relationship and then will want to go on later when they're adults to right. mentor youth. What would you say to inspire other people to become bigs? Because yeah. there's so many kids out there. It's January and everybody's <laughs> making New Year's resolutions or has and, and maybe put this on a New Year's resolution yeah. list uh, to, to, to be a mentor to a, a young individual. Uh, they have a waiting list. Uh, there's definitely a need out there. Mm. Uh, young kids these days need that extra adult or someone in their life that cares about them, that they can have a trustworthy relationship mm -hmm. with and can really help them kind of just move forward in life. Well, thank you so much, Rich. I really appreciate you coming in and sharing, you know, your experience with your little. I really do think it's a great program and hopefully more people will, you know, take that time to be a mentor. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, thank you.